Hey YouTube, Butterfly Agape here. I just wanted to come in because I haven't made a video in a little while and I wanted to kind of let you guys know along with Ray, who obviously wants to be in this video too, let you guys know some of my, um, I guess, beauty faves of this month, so of February, February since it is almost done. Um, oh, and we've been in Florida for a year. I didn't go back home. To Delaware which I thought a couple times that that might happen but you know Florida been giving it a chance and we've been doing okay so and actually better than okay so actually it's starting to feel like home so I'm happy about that anywho moving on beauty faves so one of them my first one is this beautiful lip color you can see on my lips right now oh, it's probably coming off a little bit because of all day classes, work, all of that. But that color, which I'm obsessed with L'Oreal's lipsticks now, I, anytime I'm at like Walgreens, CVS, just go to the beauty aisle, I'll go, or the beauty wall, go in L'Oreal, see which new colors I'd like to pick out. So the one I'm wearing right now is 350, which is British Red. You guys can see that. Oh, it's kind of backwards, but that's what it looks like. My co-worker Andy is obsessed with L'Oreal lipsticks and how they smell you know to each his own they just smell like I don't know something lipstick Ray I'm trying to make a video here come on get down thank you oh so rude sorry about that you guys all right so this lipstick looks like it's very nice Maybe I'll put some extra on. It is like my favorite red right now. And I have like 10 different red colors of different shades. This is definitely my favorite. So British Red, L'Oreal, you did your dang thing. All right? Because I love this color. So if you guys are in there and you want a really good red, try getting this. So that's one. That's my first one. No. Oh. Do you guys have cats? Do they climb up on all your stuff? Mm. Okay, second one is kind of my face washing brush from Sephora. They have a bigger one as well. This is the smaller one. Oh, wait, I forgot how much this costs. I really don't know. I want to say it's probably like seven, eight bucks. Probably around that, but I'll put all the prices if I remember them in the description box so you guys know. This wasn't expensive at all. This was a few bucks at Sephora. I got it so that I can help keep my skin clean when I'm washing my face. Because as you know, when you're just washing your face and you're kind of doing that motion, for me, especially like if I just had makeup on or other things, hot outside, sweat, I just feel like I really want to get in the pores. And if I'm not just using a scrub, what do you call it? Anyways, a face scrub of some sort, this really, really, really helps. So basically what I'll do is I'll take like a pea-sized amount of the face wash that I'm using, rub that into my skin, and then after it kind of gets a little sudy, I'll go over it with this in a circular motion just so I can get that extra dirt, makeup, oils, whatever's in there on my face so that I feel like I have a really, really fresh, fresh clean. So I've been using this a lot and I'm gonna make a video about my skin because I've been doing some chemical pills at this spa slash hair salon that I go to so I'll give you guys that whole process that's a whole other thing but prior to that this was helping me out a lot two that's two all right so three and I guess it's not really mine I didn't buy it I kind of just stole it from Steph so she got it as a Christmas gift different um SE nail polishes so this one, which I wish I would have had my nails painted so you guys could see, it's kind of like a top coat pink sparkly color. I've already worn it like two different times and she hasn't even had it that long. So let me see if I can put some on my nail now so you guys can see kind of what it looks like. There we go. Even though I would totally put another color underneath this, but you know, you could rock out with just the sparkles. I hate taking off sparkly nail polish afterwards. So that's my only downside for any sparkles. But if you can kind of see this color right here, 
It's really, really cute. I like it. Definitely put that over in pink, a white, any other color that you like, maybe even like a nudish color. Love, love, love this color. But my favorite to go along with that is I have been searching for a top coat. Every top coat that I have been using, my nails are still chipping. It wasn't giving me the type of use that if I go to the salon or the nail salon to get them done. Until this SE top coat. I don't know what they put in this ish, but this thing keeps my nails from chipping. Um, it keeps my color looking like I just got it done at the nail salon. I am in love. So three. And my very last thing, my fourth and final thing for this month, um, are these bracelets that I have gotten from um, Tracy Lynn Jewelry. So it's kind of like, um, just trying to see something I know to compare her jewelry to, just in case you haven't heard it. So it's not like store bought, it's basic store bought. It's catalogs or you go to like um, jewelry shows or trade show type things. You might see different people who sell Tracy Lynn Jewelry. I really love she has lots of bling bling sparkly crystally very feminine gorgeous kind of diva type jewelry but these bracelets they come in it's just like a black leather sh strap okay and they can come in gold and silver this one's a gold with the sparkles and it's backwards I know on that but as you can see it says dream oh there you can see it that way although it is sparkly when you put it on and she has lots of different ones. Like there's another one that's Faith, another one that says Hope. Um, I have the Faith, I have Faith in Silver. Oh, my mom took that actually. I have Hope, which is in gold, and this Dream one that's in gold. The reason why I love them, besides the fact that they're just super, super cute, is because every time that I wear them, honestly, it's just like a constant reminder when I look down, I'll be looking at like Dream. <sighs> okay, follow my dreams. I'm doing whatever I'm doing right now for a reason. And I just got to keep pushing or if it's faith or hope, it's just that constant reminder in a very, very cute way um, to kind of hold on or to recognize that even if you're having a bad day or anything's not kind of going your way, you know, you're doing stuff for a bigger reason or for the bigger picture. So that's kind of how it looks on. But I love it. So my Tracy Lynn Dream Bracelet, Essie Top Coat, yes. My Sephora facial brush or face scrub brush. I know there's probably an actual name for this. I don't know what the heck it is, but this is what I use. You can find it at Sephora. Ask them for something to help when you're washing your face. Dang it. I know there's a word. I don't know. We'll go with that. And the first one I said, my L'Oreal British Red Lipstick. I almost forgot. I had five things to tell you guys. I'm so sorry. And my fifth thing... I just went to the hair store not too long ago and I was looking for another conditioning spray for wigs and um, extensions and all different things and I found this one of the ladies told me about it it's called awesome and it's synthetic wig leave-in conditioning spray it's a small bottle if you want to like judge the size of my hand and I don't have huge hands um, I think it cost me like two bucks or something but this ish right here is the truth all right, because I sprayed that ish on this. Use my wig brush to comb through it. Definitely conditioned it. Definitely um, made it look newer because it was looking a little frizzy. And I needed something from my old pile to kind of bring out. So if you're looking for one and you have your usual, you might want to try it because it's not expensive at all. It's actually cheaper than the other ones. And to me, it works a lot better. So again, it's called Awesome Classic Care Synthetic Wig Leave-In Conditioning Spray. It's in a small green bottle like this it's about two bucks go get some you guys um kind of enjoyed some of my faves this month and probably longer than this month because i'm going to use this stuff constantly um if you have any questions let me know if you guys use l'oreal lipstick please tell me what your favorite one is so the next time i'm in the store i can kind of check it out it might not look perfect on me but you know i don't care i'll still check it out and if you like the essie nail polishes let me know which one's your favorite so thank you for watching and um, hope you're having a really, really beautiful day. And I wish you could see the view that I'm looking at right now. Let me see if I can turn my computer and my laptop so y'all can see. It's kind of dark. 
that's my view that I'm looking at right now. The water sitting out here on my porch, chilling. So I definitely hope that you guys are having a great day. Um, let's end with my Tracy Lynn bracelet. Make sure you're following your dreams or anything that you're doing is adding to those dreams. So I'm down. Hope you butterflies are having a wonderful day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.